Morning everyone, me again. I'm on the kids talk and I'm not on the video, which means we get to play a game. So today we are playing, who do you want to help you if? I'm gonna give you a few scenarios and you're gonna pick who's gonna be the most helpful in each situation. I wanna see your votes. You can either vote for the letter A by doing this or vote for the letter C by doing this. It's A and C because they're the easiest to do with your hands. I couldn't work out how to make a B. <laughs> so everyone gets to play. Our first scenario is, who do you want to help you if you're sick? A, a doctor, or C, a vet? That's pretty unanimous. Everyone wants the doctor. A vet could probably help you out, but the doctor's probably going to be slightly more professional. So the next scenario... Who do you want to help you when there's a fire? A, a lumberjack or a woodcutter. C, a firefighter. Everyone's going for the firefighter, that's a good idea. Unless you need to create a fire, a fire break, in which case a woodcutter might help out. Next one. Who do you want to help you when? When a tree falls down. Do you want the SES or a helicopter pilot? Yep, you want the SES, they're going to be much more helpful than a helicopter pilot. And I think this is our last one. Who do you want to help you when we have a chance to meet with God? Do you want an angel to help you out or do you want Jesus? That's right, everyone's gone with C. We do want Jesus to help us out and that's what our psalm is going to teach us today. Our psalm is going to say that Jesus is the one who can keep us safe no matter what happens. So that even when things are hard, even when trees fall down and there's fires and we get sick, we can know that Jesus is still there looking after us and that he's going to bring us to God and say, this is my brother or sister. So that's what Phil's going to be talking to us about today. I hope you enjoyed our game.